course, this is what happens right after you, right after you've beaten um this. But since I'm back, it's been five seconds, and wow, I've already freed one of my my peoples. Since I'm back, I might as well just do another let's play. So this is the the reluctant part three of Crater Maze. And I just got myself another extra life. So I'm once again in the warehouse district. Where all the busy music is. Where all the busy music is. Gee, I hope I'm not in Sailor Moon for some stupid reason. Oh, in the nick of time too. Look at that. Uh. And we get a bubble gun. And we get some more treasures. We get more booty to boot. So yeah, when you beat a certain level, when you beat just about the right amount of levels you really need to beat, you actually save your friends. Save one of your friends, at least. And with me and the power of the bubble gun, therefore I have basically shown who's what's what and how's how when I have no clue. But yeah, um, once again, this game cuteness overpowers all. Just because it overpowers all, it knows what it wants. So now that we are here, I could have say stated, but you know what? It's all good. Because you guys are getting treated to a double dose of Crater Mace tonight. You lucky devils. You lucky devils are getting a double dose of Crater Maze tonight. And I thought my job as a Let's Player was done. Oh, oh no. Oh no. It's never done. Oh no. Uh-oh, now I'm getting some speed. Uh-oh. I'm getting speed, I'm getting a warp zone, and I'm also getting a headache. Oh! And I've just been caught. But never fear, I have six lives to boot. And plenty of shovels to get. And still quite a bit of treasure to be found as I am going through this silly crater maze. So I hang around here and go around here, get this treasure, and hop into the warp zone. Warp back, get the treasure, warp back again, jump out, and jump out. And I get this helmet, which gives me some kind of power. I also have the crystal beam with its limited usage. I'm going to be warping. Yes, you're going to see a whole lot of warping here in this stage. Why? Because it's, it, it just is. Uh, anyway. <laughs> okay, I'm sick and tired of warping now. You've been crystallized. And I got speed. Am I crazy? No, I'm not high. 
I'm just on speed. So let's see. Um, I'm getting more, more and more speed, and it's crazy. And that speed is very helpful. And also that shovel is very helpful too. So we keep jumping and jumping to the next one and eventually get here, warp here. But why am I go why am I going this way? I'm trapping myself for no apparent reason. Why is that? So let's see. We warp here. No, actually, we don't warp here. We we actually make a jump here. Jump there. Bingo. And jump out. Like so. Get the key. Run like mad and go through the door. I'm sorry that took so long, but jeez. <laughs> really? It, it, it took so long, but jeez. Wow. So we're now at round 18. And I'm getting the Goonie Yo-Yo. Or I shall call it by its actual name, the Mikey Yo-Yo. The Mikey Yo-Yo, because every Mike has two. Damn it. Every Mike has one. So I accidentally ran into the water. They just don't care about us anymore. I don't think this game actually gives a rat's ass about me either. So now that we have our slow motion something, 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 something shovel. We're now reduced back to our slow, ever so slow, but so close hero. But that is okay. Because we got time stop. And that means with time stop I can do this and do this because I got Myself, the Mikey Yo-Yo again. The mighty Mikey Yo-Yo. And more range. And more hoppy hops. And more of this. And I think I got myself another extra life. It is so easy to get extra lives in this game. So I'm going to warp here. Warp there. Warp here again. Warp here. Why am I warping that way? And warp there. Go up and get this last treasure chest. Warp here. Warp there. Again, with warps. Warp there. Warp here. Come up through the side. Up here. And uh, let's see. I'm going up here. Grab the key. And why am I going that way? I'm going I'm going the wrong way. And I'm going to get this key because I think my nerves are saying, let's quit for now. <laughs> but anyway, I don't think I'm I'm crazy. Because I am not nuts. So let's see. We take care of this guy right here. Make a single jump and BAM! Easy peasy Japanese, even though it took me a couple of lives to do it. If I didn't run to the water, I would have made it fast, but that's okay. Anyway, this is round 19. 
I think round 19 is a little bit safer than safer than the last round. So we're just mopping the floor up with this game. And I got my zippies! And oh my goodness, look at all the power-ups in this. Look at all the power-ups. I got my invincibility. I'm getting nice and zippy here. So I got myself another extra life. It's very easy to get a lot of extra lives in this game. It's so very easy to trap all your enemies. And this won't take long because I'm going to get this bubble gun. Get this treasure here. Jump and flip over here with my trampoline of terror. Shoot another one of these baddies like so. Why did I do that? I have no idea. And I do believe the last two are right around here. Oh! So close. And yet, not so close. So anyway, we have this. And this. We get this. And we have just finished this stage. I think after this um, will be stage 20, and I will call it a, and I will call it a video. So we're gonna finish this run with stage 20, and um, really, I hope you enjoyed this run of Prater Maze. Being this is the, this is my 200th video special, Prater Maze, because it's funny. It says us so much about me that I am a crater maze. My mind is a crater maze. How about yours? Is it as nuts as you think it is? Are you as nuts as I am? I hope you aren't. So, the son of Bomberman, or, yeah. The so-called son of Bomberman, who kind of looked like he's a refugee from Doraemon, or he might be Doraemon in disguise. Oh, snap. Well, might as well drop you in there. Get this. Oh, snap! Woohoo! Woohoo! And just like that, folks. Ippity skippity, bing bang boom. So, with that, we are done here. Stage 20. And with that. With that, I'm just going to stop right there. Because next time... Because next time, on the Crater Maze, we shall tackle stage 21 and beyond, wherever, wherever the beyond is. But anyway, I have been Pookie Izzy 7 the always ever ready underdog of the underrated, and I wish you a good night, a good morrow, and a good wherever you are around the interwebs. Take care and goodbye.